Hello dear students, so welcome to your English class. Today we are going to discuss the next lesson in your unit 9. Okay, the name of the lesson is what if. What is the name of the lesson? What if. This is a poem written by the poet Shale Silverstein. What is the name of the poet children? It's very important. It will be asked for your exam. Name of the name of the poem and also the name of the poet. Okay. What is the name of the poet? It is Shale Silverstein. Okay. What is his name? His name is Shale Silverstein. And he is a famous American poet. Okay. He was born in USA, United States of America. So he's a famous, he was a famous American poet. Okay. And he was born in America. And his time period is between 1930 to 1999. That means he was born in 1930 and he was died in the year 1999. Okay. And he was famous as a poet, also as a cartoonist and he was a songwriter too. Okay. He was famous as a poet, cartoonist. Cartoonist means the one who draws cartoons. If you used to read uh, newspapers, you will find some cartoons, isn't it? So that is cartoonist and also he is a, yeah, sorry, he was a songwriter. He used to write songs or poems. So he's a, he was a songwriter. Okay. And his uh, actual name or his full name is Sheldon Allen Silverstein. What is his full name? His full name was Sheldon Allen Silverstein. Okay. And he used to write books for children. Okay. He used to write children's book or books for children. And in uh, children's book, he used to write his name as Uncle Shelby. Okay. So when he is writing books for children, he used to mention his name as Uncle Shelby. Okay. And he has bagged many awards or he got or he received many awards including granny awards which is one of the um uh, one of the famous award for literature okay he has uh, especially for children's literature the name of award is granny award so he has bagged many awards especially granny awards for his contributions okay to the literature okay children so this is all about uh shale silverstein and now the poem what if what if uh, generally states about uh, the what ifs or our fear about something. So when we used to uh, or when when even we people, um, uh, you know, when we lay for sleep, okay, you will, you might have many, many uh, things that will come to your mind, isn't it? Uh, some many what ifs, what ifs in the sense, uh, have you seen the advertisement uh, of, uh, one, one of the Agarbatis, Cycle Agarbatis. Have you watched that? So in that Cycle Agarbatis, one of, a child is asking many questions to his mother, isn't it? Mom, what will happen when there is no God? What will happen, uh, or who will, uh, like, uh, who will fill water inside the coconut? Okay, so many questions are raised by the student. The same thing is happening over here, that is what if. That means a student or a, a little a, a little child, he is having many questions in his mind. And this questions forms fear, fear in his mind. So that is about what if. So we'll understand the lesson uh, after reading it. And so a brief uh, summary is that. So the same way is happening over here. Ade Bolatanyana, you would pay in, even Ratri or Angan Kadakana Sameta, even the Manasil reward choding a very choding a choding a Kutramanarilla. Pakshe, Avenda Manasil reward choding a very So that is what if, other what if Angani Ayr Nangilo, Angani Angani Arangilo, in the Lakore choding at Avenda Manasiliki Variana. So this is about what if. So we'll understand the lesson uh, by reading this. Okay, thank you, students. We'll uh, read and understand the lesson.